Shalom uh, to the whole house of Yasharal and to the strangers and foreigners who are found within our gates. Um, uh, my name, Yasharal Yahu. And I just, again, wanted to come back and, and say a few words because the set apart Ruach of Yahuwah is upon me on this seventh day of the twelfth scriptural month. And I tell you, uh, the goodness of Yahuwah has no limits. And um, a quick scripture study, real quick, that I just wanted to go over is coming from um, Yeshua Isaiah chapter 43, verses 1 through 3. And it reads, But now says Yahuwah, that created you, O Yaakov, and he that formed you, O Yasharal, fear not. For I have redeemed you, I have called you by your name. When you pass through the waters, I, Yahuwah, will be with you. Amen. And through the rivers, they shall not, they shall not overflow you. When you walk through the fire, you shall not be burned, neither shall the flame kindle upon you. For I am Yahuwah, your Alua, the set apart one of Yasharal. Your Savior, I gave Egypt, Matsarium, for your ransom, Ethiopia, and Shaba for you. Amen. So, um, again, real quick, I just wanted to um, just break down this scripture. And again, like I said, the set apart Ruach of Yahuwah is upon me. I am fortunate that um, um, that He has has allowed me to make it this far. Amen. Um, when we when we look at this scripture, um, one of the things that we should uh, notice is that Yahuwah says that He created us. Again, that coincides with Yerim Yahu Jeremiah, where He says, "Before He formed us in the womb, He knew us." So you've got to kind of contemplate what were we before we were formed in the womb. A man, uh, I'm not going to expound on that part, but just what is um, the dominant aspect of this scripture study is the fact that Yahuwah says He created us. So we have got to um, comprehend that He who created us know what is best for us. A man. The second part is said is, is where He says, "Oh Yasharal, fear not." Now, again, he says, Yasharal, but I also want to extend that out to the strangers and foreigners who are found within the gates of Yasharal, all right, who are grafted in. For if you are doing the things that Yahuwah loves, then you have no reason to fear at all. A man, he says that he has redeemed us. Now, understand where Yahuwah says in um, 1 Peter, Kappa, um, he says, after a little while you have suffered, you know, he will make us perfect. He will strengthen us. He will establish us and he will settle us. Amen. So understand is that there will be trials in life as they, as you already know. Uh, some of you out there like myself are going through trials or going through tribulations. But he says, what else in this passage? When you pass through the waters, a man in the Yahudian language the mom is represented by water. Water is also um, considered chaos. So when you go through chaos, Yahuwah says, I will be with you. When you go through the rivers, they shall not overflow you. So we need to count it all joy that Yahuwah has never left, never forsaken us. Though sometimes we get down, sometimes we... we we may think that there is no other way that it can be done, but when we are trapped in despair, Yahuwah comes in and shows us that He has not made a complete end to us. Amen? So He says, I will be with you. Again, I want you to understand. Bamidabar, Numbers, chapter 23, verse 19, Yahuwah is not a man that He should lie. Nor is he a man or son of man that needs to repent. 
When he makes a promise, you can take it to the bank. Sometimes when man make a promise, be man male or female, not all the time those promises are kept. But when, we, when Yahuwah makes that promise, know that it will be kept. The only thing that we have to do is be obedient. Again, what he says in Yeshayahu, Isaiah chapter 1 verses 19 through 20. If you are obedient, you shall eat the good of the land. But if you rebel, you shall be devoured by the sword. Amen. So I just want to say that you are free to make that choice. But I, what I want to also say is that you are not free from the consequence of that choice. A man, you are not free from the consequence of that choice. He says, when you go through the, the waters, he will be with us. When you go through the fire, it will not kindle upon you. A man. So again, I'm just speaking on the fact that uh, you are protected. A man. As a matter of fact, that would be the title of this uh, quick scripture study. You are protected. Yahuwah says that when we go through the fire, it shall not be kindled upon us. When we go through the rivers, they shall not overflow us. When we go through the waters, the chaos of life, the trials and tribulations, they shall not overtake you, overcome you. A man? So... Again, um, whatever you're facing in life, whatever you're going through, um, count it all joy that no matter what, know that Yahuwah is with you. Yahuwah has redeemed you. Yahuwah is sending his Malachayim to, give, to have charge over you, to protect you, and to keep you from any evil or sickness. Amen? Again, I'm reading from Yeshayahu, Isaiah, uh, chapter 43, verses 1 through 3. And again, I'll just read it because it is profound in its structure that Yahuwah is not a man that he should lie. And if he has said something about you, if he has said something over your life, is he, if he has declared a thing in your life, know that it is going to come to pass. But now says Yahuwah. That created you, O Yaakov, and he that formed you, O Yasharal, fear not. Amen? Fear not. What does the scripture say? That he has not given us the spirit of fear, but of sound mind, of power, of strength, that we shall overcome. As long as we remain attached, committed to Yahuwah. Um, for I have redeemed you, he says. I have called you by your name. When you pass through the waters, I will be with you. And through the rivers, they shall not overflow you. When you walk through the fire, you shall not be burned, neither shall the flame kindle upon you. For I am Yahuwah, Yahalua, the set apart one of Yasharal. Your Savior, I gave Mansarium, Egypt, for your ransom, Ethiopia and Sheba for you. So again, Mashpikah, count it all joy. Call up to the Shamayim, call up to the heavens, call up to Yahuwah. Thank him for all the things that he has done in your life. Because I know in mine, I didn't do it by myself and I would never claim such a thing. For it would be false upon me and after such a claim, a severe consequence would follow. But I want to know. I, I'm sorry, I want you to know that you are protected. Fear not. For those that may come against you one way, they will depart from you seven ways. Amen. This is the word of Yahuwah. This is not my word. For again, I will not take credit for the word of Yahuwah, but this is the word that he has given unto his people. His word is sharper than any double-edged sword. Is and is more valuable than any, than any gold, any silver, anything. A man. 
um, one thing that that is on my heart too is a song that he just placed there. And this song, the melody, it comes from uh, CC Winans. And uh, of course, she sings it as she knows it, uh, what is true to her heart, but I have to sing it according to my heart and what is true to me. And of course, what is true to me or who is true to me is Yahuwah. But again, I want y'all to remember Yeshayahu, Isaiah chapter 43, verses 1 through 3. I want you to fear not, for even as the Yahudim were in the wilderness, before we got to the promised land, he was there, he sustained us, he kept us from all hurt, harm, and danger. Amen? So you're on the, you're on the cusp of getting into your promised land. You're on the cusp of being delivered. You're on the cusp of being healed. Again, I say currency of obedience is more valuable to Yahuwah than any other thing. For it is with disobedience is when we are devoured by the sword. Is when the severe consequence comes upon us. But, um, uh, I, uh, again, I want to sing this song because, uh, it, it, uh, it touched me when I heard, uh, CC Winans, um, a version of it. The melody is just like, wow. So I had wanted to, uh, uh, put my version to it. And, uh, here it is. Now, let me, let me tell you, I can't sing. Not one bit, but Yahuwah has commanded me to sing unto him a joyful noise. And as long as your heart is centered on Yahuwah, the words that come out of your mouth will be pleasure unto his ears and and, a, and to be a delight thereof. Amen. Now, you can go and listen to the song uh, wherever you listen to music at or whatever it may be. Uh, but this this is my version. Again, I want you to know, Mashmaka. Uh, I want you to know, Yasharal, that um, you are protected. Yahuwah shall not leave nor forsake us. Amen? All right, all right. Um, here we go. I love you, Father. Your compassion never fails me. All my days I've been held in your hand. From the moment that I wake up Till the time I lay my head down Oh, I will sing Of the goodness of Yahuwah All my life you have been faithful All my life you have been good With every breath I praise you cause I'm able from the moment that I wake up Till the moment I lay my head down Oh, I will praise the name of Yahuwah I love your voice You have led me through the fire In my darkest night You're close like no other I know you as my father, I know you as my friend, and I have lived in the goodness of Yahuwah. From the moment that I wake up, till the time I lay my head down, oh I will worship the greatness of Yahuwah. Come on, y'all. Y'all sing with me now. Y'all know that is a good melody. That is a good song. Um, give praise unto Yahuwah. I love you as my father. Your compassion never fails me. All my days I've been held in your hands. From the moment that I wake up till the time I lay my head down. Oh, I will sing of the goodness of Yahuwah. All my life you have been faithful. 
All my life you have been good With every breath I praise you cause I'm able From the moment that I wake up Till the time I lay my head down Oh, I will praise the name of Yahuwah. I love you as my father. I love to hear your voice. You have led me through the fire. In my darkest night, you're close like no other. And I have lived. In the greatness of Yahuwah From the moment that I wake up Till the moment I lay my head down Oh, I will worship The greatness of Yahuwah uh, Oh, I will worship The greatness of Yahuwah Oh, I will sing of the goodness of Yahuwah. Oh, Yasharal, to all the strangers and foreigners who are found within our gates, go in peace. I pray humbly, Yahuwah, that you would allow your Malachayim to give charge over us or to give your Malachayim charge over us that no evil or sickness shall overcome us, shall befall us. That you would hold us, O Yahuwah, in the palm of your hand. Touch us in a mighty and a special way. Keep us strong physically, mentally, and spiritually, Father. That you would cast us not away from your presence and take not your set-apart Ruach away from us. But allow your set-apart Ruach, O Yahuwah, to rest, rule, and abide in us. That we shall know your righteousness. And while on this walk, you shall be unto us. A light to our path and a fire upon our feast. In the mighty name of Yahusha, by Sham, Yahusha, I pray. Amen. Paratazaun Shalak, Yaya Asha. O Yasharal, Mashpacha, I want you to go in peace, go in love, uh, be safe, stay healthy. I love you. I love you with the, with the love of Yahuwah and, and, Stay in his word, stay in his love, and stay in his presence. Until next time.